grand morning, grand evening. Depending on when you guys watch this video. Look like I'm looking up in the air, but I'm looking in the video, I guess I'm not. Being a businessman, oh man. Being a businessman has its ups, its downs. It's all, it's, it's just an amazing journey that you go through. Some days are good, some days, some days are bad. A lot of stuff I really didn't even know about because it's my first time owning a business and doing it full time for my income and everything. And uh, I was just listening to um, Jen Rowan earlier this morning. He was basically saying that becoming a millionaire is fine, but the process and the journey of getting there is what is all worth because if you lose the million dollars that you made, at least you know how to get it back. So I try to explain that to some of my people that even if the business is up or down or no business is at all, the journey is what it's worth. Just the simple fact as in, I am learning so much different things about myself, about people, about business, about being a business owner. And this is not designed for everybody. I've learned that so I see why some people have their own business but it only goes to a certain level because it's more to it and to it in just being an owner. Sacrifice, discipline, of course. Um, you have to be creative on, and make things happen. You have to have a hustle mentality. And I notice that some people have a good hustle mentality, but not business business savvy. And then some people have a good, uh, very business savvy, but don't have the hustle mentality. Then some people just don't even have the uh, discipline. They have weak points so or they're limited to their strengths or their um, failures which they don't know that they have because they're not in tune with themselves so for me I'm in tune with my uh, my faults and I know that I need to work on my faults and I learned that by working here with my own booth at Navy Pier and it's a journey it's, it's interesting but owning a business is something else I wouldn't trade it for nothing in the world. And like I told my mentor that the best thing about this here is that once you learn how to open and start a business, that's all I really need to learn. So if it's not about squanky, which is always gonna be about squanky, it can be about other things that I wanna get into. But just the simple fact of me learning and educating myself and through wisdom, wisdom of others, do's and don'ts, it makes you feel good as a business owner. So today, right now, um, it's kinda slow at Navy Pier. So I said, let me come outside and do a video here in the midst of this beautiful weather. It's kind of um, not cold, but it's it's really nice. So I'm out here now at Navy Pier. And just this alone, being here amidst, amongst this here is inspirational for me. This let me know that, okay, Cliff, coming from the south side of Chicago, and now you have a store out here at Navy Pier, that right there alone says a lot to me. It's not for bragging rights. It's not to say I'm all that. It's just a simple fact that in something that I didn't think I can even do that's very small to a lot of people, but to me is major, is being done. So I love that. So peace and blessings, like I always say, if no one told you they love you, I definitely love you guys. And I appreciate the support. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.